One of the uh, key uh, incentives for us to move global is the dollar. Today, uh, eight, well, yesterday, 85% was uh, Euro-based in my supply chain. Today, only 69%. However, I am paid fully in dollar. So there's a great challenge to, de to develop a, a global sourcing at the, uh, at the doorstep of Aeolia. Before going to um, the uh, so-called uh, agility and relationship, just a, uh, a snapshot vision of the sourcing strategy. How do we, uh, from the global vision you've seen from the Airbus Group, how do we develop in Aeolia, and what's in it for you, supplier, in India? We, we had a vision, which is to go top three in the world for our, uh, let's say, uh, for the air structure. As two-thirds of what we do is being done by our supplier, we had to uh, implement a sourcing strategy that will be in line with that uh, top three in the world vision. And therefore, we based ourselves on four strategy elements, so, uh, so much for the wickets, uh, we don't have those here, uh, Chandra, uh, don't play too much uh, cricket myself. So we had four strategy elements. First and foremost is a lean supply chain concept. Second, total cost of ownership, which means, we'll see in a minute, that if I look at an Indian supplier, I do not look at the dollar per hour. I don't look at the dollar per kilogram that, is, that can be offered here locally. I'm looking at the overall cost that we actually share with our Indian sourcing office to source, to develop the supplier, to uh, ship the parts or the work package back in Europe to eventually grow locally some supply chain and some value added. So this is what we call the total cost of ownership. 